All right, ready? Ooh, Paris. In France. <laughs> wow. Ooh, that's a little better. Oh, wow. <laughs> Come on, Mickey Mantle, rookie. <laughs> no? This is an entire collection of sheet music, and it's all looks to be in pretty good condition. Oh, what do we have here? Military. Previously on Locker Nuts, this was an exciting auction day with quite a few nice looking units. The competition was stiff, so the storage auction pirate and I teamed up to buy the one we both wanted the most. This 10x10 was dusty and super intriguing. The dust and cobwebs made us have to have it, and we paid a whopping $5,000 to get it. So far, it's been everything we hoped, filled with vintage treasures and stuff we've never seen before. The two dusty trunks we went through may have already paid for the entire unit with exciting finds such as pre-World War II trains. Amazing. Day two and we are back for more digging and I think it's going to be exciting. Here we go. What's up Locker Nuts? Alright, it's day two. Going back to this fan what looks to be a fantastic unit. So far has been a fantastic unit that I teamed up with the storage auction pirate on. Ah, five grand we spent on this, but already I think we're pretty close to seeing our money back. But I'm running late. I'm running late. I'm about 25 minutes late to work today. And I'm just dreading hearing it once I get there. I know Mike's going to give me some slack over it. All right, well, guess what? Mike's not here. So uh, technically, I guess I'm not late. Ah, I feel a little relieved not to have to take the the butt chewing over being almost half an hour late last time we partnered up i was late the first day i think by like five minutes and boy he gave it to me second day he rolled in right behind me so i gave him a little back but um anyways i'm not gonna get fired today <laughs> that's the good news and now i can give him some grief when he pulls in although he probably was here before and just went down the market or something doesn't matter i'm first i got here first and I got a video to prove it. Oh yeah, just to scan the area, see, he's not here. <laughs> Good morning. See that, I'm representing today. I'm representing. Here's the sign of our day yesterday that is the progress we made we've made a hole actually we could probably both stand inside the locker if it weren't covid all right check this out guys we took the water bed panels out there's a ready for the dump over there but this is hiding behind it and look at how interesting this is un cartridges for weapons what do you think's in there all right ready Oh, 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 look, I don't know what that is, but Ooh. it looks like gun stuff, doesn't it? It sure does. It looks great. Holster. P4, I don't see a maker It'd be nice mark. to find one from a German Ruger. Those are good. They're just the holsters are a couple hundred bucks. Oh, really? I've got one, but it's so old, it's destroyed. BBK, that's nice. That's, that's not his initials. initials, is it? That's somebody's initials. Maybe an old cowboy. His last Billy the Kid? Uh, no. What's Billy the Kid's middle name? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Hunter. would be crazy if we found something like that. Right, let's see if I get to Close enough. Looks like it says Hunter. That's nice. the maker. That is nice. Do you remember hearing on the news like two years ago how they sold a photo of Billy the Kid for $5 million? It was yeah. a rare photo of him. Didn't someone get a first sale or something like that? Something, something ridiculous. Ooh, that is heck of sharp it does not even look sharp but very old if you look at the the wood and just the crudeness of it hmm. no makers more how sharp that is well it's been sharpened for sure you can see the tip is sharpened down a little bit but oh Ooh, paris in france <laughs> look at that that's like the queen's emblem 
Dang, this one's heck of sharp too. This is razor sharp. Dang, what we got here? These look like parts to a gun to me. That's like the spring loading and all that. It's up for an older gun. Okay. 2295 in 1991. That's what we, the newspapers were dated 1991. That's the newest we found of anything in here. Some little leather pieces. Oh, neat. Except for holding. Is this where your magazines go or no? I think it might be. I feel it. There's like cardboard or something in there. Ball ammo, 5.562. So this would be where your, your actual ammo cartridges come in. See, that's what these are. Oh. 20 rounds. Huh. They come in little sleeves, right? They, it, it, it slides off. Oops. It's not the camera. Gun cleaning. All we see here is gun, 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 but no projectile dispenser. Actual. Another little, I think that's for clips as well. Magazines, I always say the wrong one. Me too. An Alden Knight. That's World War II. Ooh. 1945. <laughs> that, World War II is always the best military stuff for some reason. You would presume World War I would be more valuable, but it's... Uh -huh, look at that. There's a bunch of them, and there's another bullet. Didn't we find some of those exact ones yesterday? I think so. Man, I They're would love to different. find what these go to. Me too. You might. That's actually pretty expensive, that little heat right there. Is it? It has the potential. The, the hands, the, the extra magazine pieces for those, or um, grips could be money for original ones. Got a lot of parts here for guns, but Ooh, what is this? That's all it'll do. I think the blade's supposed to go with it. Or something. Pretty cool. This is illegal or not? Yeah. Comment below if you guys know if this is illegal. This type of piece right here. Kinda feel like it should be. <laughs> In California just about everything's illegal, so probably. Pretty cool. Got some 22s right here. Not bad. All right, this is another piece that was right next to that ammo box. It appears to be copper. Um, too bad it's got a big dent right here, but it's a really neat piece. Really neat piece. I like this right here. Uh, it's cool. Cleaned up, this is gonna be a really nice piece for somebody. Look at that. New York World's Fair. 1964, 1965. Piece through understanding. Well, it's a little bit rough shape, but pretty cool. Very stiff football here. Like if I squeeze it too hard, I think it's gonna crack up. National Football League players, all stars. Looks like just facsimiles on there. Got a lot of them though. But the condition on this thing is toasted, roasted. Look at this item right here, hiding back here. This is a robot positioner. What is this thing? Like, robot positioner. I've never seen one of those. Huh. Model EPR-203. So this got a cover right here. It's got some kind of a... Want me to look it up real quick? Sure. Let's see, see if it, one's like on the hydraulics here. right here. Robot positioner. It's made in Japan. Nagano Japan Radio Company. Okay, NHE. None on eBay, but whatever. All robot positioners are very expensive, upwards of 60 grand down to like five grand. But oh. we gotta figure, that's obviously an older one, right? Uh, it's gotta be, yeah. It's gotta be at least 30 years old. Oh, I'm excited to you. And then there's the old wives tale the daddy long legs are the most poisonous spider what i never even heard that yeah they just can't the only thing they can penetrate is your mouth they were inside your mouth oh jeez i used to play with them as a kid i mean just let them crawl 94. on your head oh wow that's a lot of paper oh wow Ooh, that's a little better oh wow <laughs> come on mickey mantle rookie this is sealed that's a little Ooh. that's a little decent right even if it's newer it's still sealed well baseball cards are making a major comeback Okay. It's like the whole set, Pacific. maybe. Pacific. 
It's nice that they're it's still in football. good shape. Like the outside of the box was just deteriorated and covered in stuff, but then you opened up and the box is all just crisp and This is good. This is set probably. Let's, I think so. I mean, well you check that, I'll do a little bit of Yeah, look, it's one, two, three, four. He's got they're a, all numbered, huh? That's what I love about stamp people. Stamp people psychologically are very organized people. Look at that. First card in the greatest car greatest quarterback ever. Nope. Steve Young, yes. That's number one. Yeah. So again, yeah, another set. Some, score. Got a Raiders. Tim Brown is your guy. Nice. That's Michaela's guy. I love the OCD uh, collectors. <laughs> Ooh, there it is again. Did the same set. Another score, but probably a different year. Ninety. That was ninety-one. Christian Okoye, the Nigerian nightmare. Is football better than baseball for 90? Um, I'm uncertain. It's What matters is who's rookie card, right? Um, is that what it always boils down to? Probably. There's 88. Oh, wow. This, oh, he's missing 87 a couple. 87 is Jerry Rice's rookie, right? I'm missing. No, I forget. 85? Uh, I don't know. I used to have all these cards. Really? Oh, yeah. I have to collect these. Not me. 15, somebody stole our entire storage unit. Some tweaker stole a whole 10 by 30, and we stored some stuff in his garage. We went out, of, we moved the other side of the state, and he burned everything in a bonfire that didn't sell. So oh, we sold geez. all of our stuff and burned it all in a bonfire. So that's why I don't like collecting things anymore. Yeah. I don't know if you ever heard that story. Before. I have not. I like Magic Johnson. I mean, this is all Magic Johnson. Isn't it ironic that I ended up becoming a storage buyer? It is. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. <laughs> Magic Johnson's good. Ooh. Oh, what have we found a Michael Jordan rookie card? Is it Michael Jordan? I don't know. Yeah, and this is this is him, but we're later. gonna need to get a little bit. His rookie was gonna be right here, 8045. Man, we found a Michael Jordan rookie. I've never found one of those. That's my favorite player of all time. No. Yeah. I named my daughter after him. Just kidding. <laughs> Her name is Michaela Jordan Dijas. And you also have a Carl Michael. Malone. This is all great. So look at these. The, these are legends in that era. Nice. Yeah. Oh, I want to find a Michael Jordan rookie now. They all look like they're in excellent condition. Yeah. It's Almost like we, you can grade some of them. This is a neat box. Yeah, this is pretty good. It's a good sign. Patrick Ewing was a legend. I mean, this has got to be at least a couple hundred bucks right here. Minimum, I'm hoping right? that they're... Yeah. At least... I would agree, but what I'm hoping, because base cards are made a major comeback. Ever since sports and Corona, like the market went shot through the roof. And Gary V also, he he helped with that a little bit. Eighty nine. That's kind of cool. More football. Ooh, look, it's women cards. Oh, these are the wives. I used to have this one. Oh, really? Yeah, I remember I this now. I've never seen that before. This this year they did wives. How funny. Yep. Yeah, this is Bill Cosby's wife on the TV. It is. Who is she married to? Whose wife was she? Felicia Rash Oh, yeah, that's right. Rashawn. Oh, I never knew that. <laughs> cool. What year is this? This is uh, 91. Okay. Yeah. 91 is this guy's year, huh? I'm peeking ahead. Go ahead. No, I don't. I'll wait my turn. You know I love cards. This is a good... Ooh! What's that, Jack? What was it? Those garbage pail kids, I think, right? Or am I tripping? Mm. Oh, I thought it was. It looked like it for a second. Now uh, the back Still of cool, Oh, that's a Bo Jackson. Didn't, doesn't that kind of look like the back of a garbage pail kid at first? If you just look at it real quick at a glance, or am yeah. I tripping? Yeah, no, it does. I love it. 1989, too. Getting a little bit older. I love Bo Jackson. Okay. Yeah. Wow, they got more solid. Did you hear that? Hockey. Listen. Uh, Get more solid as you go. This one was solid, this box. So a lot more like this, I think. Stadium Club was good, but it's hockey. Hockey was not. Mm -hmm. was oh, yeah. Number one, so he's got the I rock. was never big into hockey. Me neither. But then there's some people who are just like, hockey's the only sport. Basketball players are wussies. Ooh, top stadium. No, a couple over there. Those are kind of cool. Stickers. A lot of the Again, upper decks had errors, like the uh, Ken Griffey, I think, had an error, and then there was the um, the Ripken brother who had the bat with the word F-U written on it. Oh, yeah. 
I think uh, that's Griffey's brother, but I could be wrong. 91 on this too. Usually I'm not impressed when we find these years, but like I said, cards have made a major comeback because these eras are now old enough. Nice. Yeah, we sold... Wait a second, this is Ken Griffey Jr. here. That's a rookie, top rookie, so that's so, one of the better cards to find in this. So this might be worth some. What year? It's probably 91. You know, and this guy, oh, these are Desert Storm ones here. Nice. That's kind of cool. Yeah, well, fresh and... Not making anymore, right? Don Ruiz, or Don Russ. Still wrapped, but it's a little torn, and then some 1990 hockey. We call that slightly sealed? I think it's still sealed, yeah. These are uh, new. There, there has to be old cards in here because of the era of everything we found so far and then that there has to be at least a box of those two boxes there that's oh, the those. ones that he was like in his, like his heart was drawn to those two oh, so really yeah i'm always uh, little ones. curious of other people's intuition oh huh. yeah well, there is a lot more because i did peek in there and i saw that and oh that one and these ones we everyone saw okay we made some progress here open some really cool stuff here guys um that we just finished this unboxing you have to see that on the storage auction pirates channel went through an ammo box incredible stuff incredible stuff jewelry gold um just amazing really it's why we bought this locker it is in hopes of finding stuff like that but uh we are right now trying to carve a path this way and uh get back 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 so that's what we're gonna be working on right now okay oh dollies does this belong to mary poppins that's pretty fancy. Yeah. Can you imagine me just frolicking through the forest like the or the, or the park? Yeah, I can. Yeah. Look at the look at the craftsmanship on it. The, just this is very old. I've never seen. I think it is old. Huh? Yeah. And the material is just like almost look like made of like leaves. Wow. Ooh, are these bagpipes? That's what it kind of looks like. <laughs> No. Uh, this stuff is very old. I don't even want. I'm, it's kind of already just. It sucks because some of the stuff's like old, so old. It's, it's brittle, huh? Yeah. Look at that though. Hmm. <laughs> little chalkboard or picture frame is like doll furniture. Are any of these have extreme value? You think? I don't know. The last time we found the last one we teamed up on, we found those very old dolls. We put them in our auction. I was disappointed by those were how cheap they were. Different ones. They weren't the right ones, because those type of dolls are made, mass-produced by everybody. Mm, those ones were? Oh, well, yeah, that style of clay and stuff like that, there's molds and you could just make them. And you have to find one that's got the right maker marks, you know. Mm hmm. I don't know, this stuff doesn't like this one. It's creepy. Huh. One has a tag on it. Yeah. Clump. Ooh, look at this. Whoa. That's cool. It's got the spear in them too from oh. bullfighting mm. right is that what it is maybe well they're just supposed to be wings i don't know oh uh, maybe this is a clump does that sound right clumps gumps nope clumps barcelona these are neat yeah they're old policeman they're humble hansel and gretel maybe mm -hmm. <laughs> no? I used to play with dolls when I was a kid. It's alright. Yeah. Me and my sister would take like all of our G.I. Joes, all of her Barbies, uh, my little ponies. I'd bring out the Legos and we would take turns picking each piece like this. She would pick this one, I would pick that one. <laughs> yeah. Until we had everything divided and we'd make these fortresses and then battle each other. The world's smallest doll. A Dutch shoe. I like yeah. that stuff. Being as I'm Dutch. Hmm, something's in here. Look something's at that. In there. Dolls. Yeah. Are these the good dolls? Uh, could be. Oh, got me. Okay. Hmm. There's no father. Is this like a d d divorce set or something? Or he didn't show the altar set? She's a widow, maybe? Hey, maybe. Oh, sorry. That was rude. All right, how about this one? How about this one? Let's see. I 
don't know what this is. Delaney Butil. Maybe that's someone's name. Or the milk glass. Yeah. School. Cool. Okay. Cleveland, Ohio. Yeah, that's neat. That's old. Old thermometer. Oh, that's ovenware. Ovenware, interesting. Twenty-five cents. <laughs> yeah, it probably was in 1987. 1991. Hmm. I feel some good ephemera coming up. The plastic's just de deteriorating in my hands because it's so brittle. Well, you're so strong, too. Oh, that's true. There's always that, huh? I gotta be careful. I don't ruin everything. My brute strength. Yeah. Oh, it's some music. Isn't that good? I think so. Dude, we found a bunch of music. Oh, these are cool. You know cool. what people like about me this type of sheet music? It's the covers. This mm. is the type of stuff people put in the frame and hang on the wall. Dang, that's, that is a nice piece. Actually, it's just the cover. Or maybe that's the whole song. Huh. Very neat. Okay. That's all right. The artsy covers more than it is the sheet music inside. Like, how many people want to hear Maurice Chelliver, Playboy of Paris, you know? there It's the art, like that. These are cool. This is a collection of its own right here. Oh, wow, look at that. This is an entire collection of sheet music, and it's all... Looks to be in pretty good condition. Very interesting. Uh, this says 10 cents on it. <laughs> Not anymore. Okay, now here's a bunch of music. Uh, but it's missing the cover. And there's the pirate filming an uh, intro. Hi, Jay. Are you still on your first video? Yeah. Oh. What do we have here? Military. Long Island, huh? It is military, right? I think so. This is like World War One era, though. Look at this. Oh, this is old. You can tell by the feel of it. Mm. Maybe I'm wrong, but... I don't know what this is. Some sort of uniform. Look how old the hangar is. Nope. Merson clothes. Let me look this up for us real quick. Uh-oh, what have we got here? New York Fire Department wool trench coat overall coat dress. Fire Department. Yeah, I can see that. Okay. That's that's pretty similar. Is it? Yeah, it's it's a little different. No. Maybe. It had four buttons. Or no, six, and six. then probably another one. It really feels like it because look, there's the tag. Yeah. It looks similar. Huh. I don't know. Something. It's something similar to that. Gates Ambulance Oxygen Service. Okay. I don't know. I'm getting somewhere. It's still. They have a special wood hanger. Look, there's even a wood. This, I'm showing images of it, too. That's weird. I don't know why, but it happened to show images of old hangers. <laughs> Person close. Hangers. All right. That's tight. There's something here. Close. Tight. <laughs> then I wonder if that has some, the other piece is going to be similar, too. It's not Versace, but it's I pretty damn cool. Look, at, look how many times we've have found something I haven't found. That's what makes this unit exciting to me, is I'm not bored for it. <laughs> Yep. It's the older one. No? It's different. It has a different feel, but... Ooh, here it is. Police Department New York. New York Police Department. Oh. That's nice. This is a this is a New York police outfit. Old one. Very old. Mm. What does this say? See how we didn't pay attention then on the first one? It was War Off More. Oh. Couldn't read it. Could only read a little bit. But yeah, regulation. This one's very clean. So someone in the family is from New York, huh? It's gonna be something, the, a, the right collector. Ooh. All right, we having fun yet? That's cool. It's good. You happy? I'm, I've been happy. I couldn't sleep last night. Oh, 
Oh, this is good. Okay. What do you think? I think that's a good looking little chinky box. Oh. Oh. Yes. I have the bad I see sterling silver right here. 